Regulatory life cycle management is a significant burden for life sciences companies today, consuming in the region of 60% of regulatory resources. Industry leaders are rethinking their approach to regulatory life cycle management as they seek to refocus resources more strategically. Life cycle management processes include changes in CMC and labeling that span multiple departments and can take months or years to complete. Maintenance submissions like renewals, PSURs, and annual reports require content coordination, publishing, and submission tracking to tight regulatory timelines. And tender bids and new rest-of-world filings require careful redaction and preparation of follow-on dossiers while maintaining a clear audit trail to the core product dossiers. These regulatory life cycle processes require data and documents from across the multiple quality, regulatory, and safety systems in the enterprise, yet lack any coherent, process-focused technology to track and measure the process, simplify the user experience, and reliably capture all regulatory compliance data. GenPAC's System of Engagement for Regulatory Life Cycle Management solves this problem by bringing the people, data, documents, and process together using agile, cloud-based digital technologies. The application has pre-configured workflows and is easily adjustable for each client's needs. It uses validated connectors to exchange the required data with the underlying systems of record. Let's take a look at the application in more detail. All lifecycle processes involve many users with different roles. As each user logs on, they see a prioritized list of their time-bound tasks for all changes involving them. As each change moves through its lifecycle, the Change Request Dashboard fills up in blue and shows each of the complete or ongoing activities in each phase with a red, amber, or green status as appropriate. Clicking on any particular change title gives a consolidated view of the change to date, in this case, a CCDS change. Note the option to execute the change in 45 or 90 days, the impact analysis results, the impacted countries, and so on. A key feature of our system of engagement is to interact with the relevant systems of record where users perform many of their assigned tasks. Here, the user needs to concur an impact assessment in the change control system. Once done, he can pull this information back into the application from the change control system or wait for the overnight synchronization. The ability to track the authoring of the required content to execute the lifecycle management event is also enabled. Here the application is interacting with the document management system to pull the version numbers and status of the required documents as determined by the impact assessment. Another feature is pulling events data from the registration management system. Here the user can execute the HQ release step and pull the impacted countries from the registration management system. Once a core dossier has been released, the regulatory staff responsible for the local markets can assess which documents need to be submitted locally and then request a published dossier. Additional content can also be requested. Once published, the user receives a task to submit the dossier. She can enter the submission date directly into the task. This is then passed automatically to the registration management system. Once submitted, the system can also capture health authority questions. The change request dashboard updates to indicate that a clarification is required. Once approval is received, the data and approval letter can be captured. These can also be pushed automatically to the registration management system. The final stage is archiving, where all items in the change record can be pushed back to the underlying systems of record as required. The application can also report on all data captured through the processes. We can see stats by user, where tasks are overdue in red, but also where tasks are being consistently completed well within the allocated time, indicating that a shortening of the task time may be in order. We can also review the change requests, looking for issues indicated in red, 
and understand if the issues are due to specific manufacturing sites, countries, or phases, for example. The application is mobility-enabled, out of the box. Users can access their tasks or dashboards while on the move. Integrating with GenPak's Advanced Analytics, our Smart Decision Lab can provide enterprise-wide drill-down dashboards. The application has configurable modules for all possible regulatory lifecycle management activities. Renewals, for example, are a key maintenance requirement. Our application also has a module for compliance gap assessments, used to assess the quality of incoming dossiers, from an acquisition, for example. In conclusion, GenPak's System of Engagement for Regulatory Lifecycle Management is a digital platform that delivers a single, unifying layer to manage lifecycle processes and give an aggregated view of the data in real time. End-to-end -end workflows, automating currently manual handoffs. A simplified and contextual user interface to dramatically improve the user experience a portal to increase data quality and transparency, thereby improving regulatory compliance. An agile, flexible, and highly adaptable application that interacts with systems of record to bring data and documents to the process. Discover more about GenPak's systems of engagement and regulatory lifecycle management today. Visit us at genpak.com.